as you can see this right here is my simplex 2001 fire alarm panel i showed this a long time ago back when i had some other videos that are now since privatized but here it is i haven't shown it in, an own de in its own dedicated video yet so let's take a look at all the cards that we have in here all right so before we look at the cards i want to show this little tag right here on the inside of the door this is a type 2001 3080 it is a repack model so this is the uh, small version with the red cabinet um that's your uh oh, where is it there's the serial number right there id is uh 2001 80 21 so really I don't know which one this is. It's either a 2001 3080, that might be the uh, can, and 2001 80-21 might be the card holders, or the main board or something like that. Not quite sure. 120 volt input, 24 volt DC, 24 volt DC signals, 2 amps. Um, So right here, this was manufactured November 16th, 1982. So this is a pretty old unit right here. Installed December 18th, 1984. So yeah, there's that little tag. So now let's go take a look at the cards, shall we? So now I've opened up the panel and we can take a look at all the cards here. Starting here on the far left, we have the main system control card. It's got all of your functions, like acknowledge, the reset, LED test, which... Then the, uh, the trouble sounder. Right here is the first zone card. It's got two zones on it, with the uh, disconnect switches, like so. And if I were to flip them all the way up, you would get an alarm. Um, next one is a smoke power card. I'm not doing anything with this right now, but basically what it does is it gives out power for four-wire smoke detectors, and you can disconnect that power with this little switch right here. This right here is the march time card. We all know what this does, but it codes the horn and the light on this board to march time. Got another zone card just like this one. Same disconnect switches like so. Right here is the nap card. It does have a treble on it just because the uh, the horns don't have any resistors on them. But they have these fuses you can take out like so. That can be used to disconnect the knacks. Two knacks on that card. Right here is a relay card that doesn't really do anything but it's just there for looks. And finally, we have a, another zone card, but this one doesn't have the test or disconnect switches on it. Two zones. So overall, we have six zones, two NACs, two relays, march time, smoke power. Nice little set of cards. So let's go take a look at the rest of the board. All right, so there's only really two devices on this board. First we've got this, this 4251-20, matches pretty well. Um, and for the notification appliance we have this. This is my Simplex 2901-9806 horn on my 2903-9005 light plate. I actually have three of these combo units right here. This is actually a very rare variation of the light plate. It actually has two bulbs on either side which is pretty cool. Up here we just have a little junction box that I will probably eventually put a smoke detector in, but right now it is empty. The thing is, is that I don't plan on ever really changing out these devices, so they will probably stay the same. So yeah, there it is. Without further ado, let's test. Let's pull it, shall we?
Now, something I'm going to show real quick is that I can re-alarm these switches. As you can see right there. So now let's go ahead and reset. And there's that. So that's going to be the end of the video for today. As always, thank you for watching. Make sure to check out my group, me and eBay. Both links are in the description. Thank you and have a great day.